everyone. Today we'll be reviewing Mike and Armand's flag. The review will be done using the five basic principles of flag design as outlined in the book Good Flag, Bad Flag, written by Ted Kay and published by the North American Vexillological Association. Here is a quick rundown of the five principles. We will review the flag under each principle and give a score out of 10 for each. At the end, we will calculate the average score of the five principles, which will give us the overall final score for the flag. Let's begin. The flag is split into two distinct designs, one on the hoist and one on the fly. The hoist consists of a checkered pattern of black and white. The fly consists of five horizontal alternating stripes of black and red. Overall, the design is pretty simple, though combining the two separate designs together might be a little tricky to get right. For this principle, the flag scores 9.5 out of 10. The flag is a combination of the personal flags of Mike and Armand, who are in a relationship together. This is Mike's flag, and this is Armand's flag. Here we can see how the two flags combine to give us their flag. The symbolism of Mike's flag is the following. The white rectangles convey the four cardinal points as well as conveying the general shape of a flower. It also symbolizes the snow, while black alludes to the rocks in the region where Mike comes from. The symbolism of Armand's flag is the following. Black represents his dark past, while red symbolizes his efforts to overcome and his hope for the future. Red is also his favorite color. The symbolism of the individual flags carries forward to their combined flag. The following additional symbolism applies to the flag. The black squares connecting with the black stripes symbolize the union of Mike and Armand, while the separation of the two designs represents the fact that they are two people and they retain their individual personalities. Overall, this is excellent symbolism. For this principle, the flag gets 10 out of 10. The flag has three colors. Those are black, white, and red. All three colors are part of the standard set. Regarding contrast, the black and red stripes don't have great contrast because they are both dark colors. This contrast issue also occurs where the red stripes connect with the black squares. Also, while the connection of the black squares and black stripes provide good symbolism, it makes the two distinct patterns of the flag a little difficult to distinguish. Overall for color, the flag scores 6.5 out of 10. The flag has no lettering, seals, or coat of arms. For this principle, the flag gets 10 out of 10. The flag is very distinctive, thanks to the combination of the two individual flags into one. For this principle, the flag scores 10 out of 10. So now we review the flag on each of the five principles. We're going to add the scores and divide by five to get the average. So for Mike and Armand's flag, we get a final score of 9.2 out of 10. Do you have a great flag design? Do you want us to review the flag using the five basic principles of flag design? Well, now is your opportunity. So here is what you need to know. Send your flag designs to flagthisvideos at gmail.com and include the following information. Your name. Nicknames or usernames are perfectly fine if you don't want to give us your real name. What your flag represents. This may be a country, but you can submit a flag for states, cities, provinces, or just about anything else you think of. Please give us details of what inspired your idea, especially regarding symbolism. For example, what do the colors represent? If you include any shapes, symbols, or objects, let us know what they symbolize. If you're designing a brand new flag from scratch, try to make it distinctive. If you want to modify a currently used flag, let us know why you think your design is better. Please make sure your file is no more than 1600 by 1600 pixels and no less than 800 by 800 pixels. We accept all the most commonly used file types. If you have more than one flag design, please send a separate email for each. 
So what are you waiting for? Send us your designs and stay tuned to see your flag get reviewed. As always, remember to check out our videos and if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to our channel and spread the word. Thank you for watching.